Thanksgiving season is upon us. What's your favorite part of Thanksgiving? You know, a lot of people refer to Thanksgiving as Turkey Day. It's a day we get together with our families, we have the traditional meal, we watch football, and we're together. And that, and that can be a very good thing. But at the same time, if we only get stuck thinking of Thanksgiving as Turkey Day, I, I think there really is a major problem in the way we're viewing something that could be a spiritual occasion. So many times throughout the Bible, we're reminded to give thanks. Did you know that in the New King James Version of the Bible, over 40 times those words are used, give thanks, praise God, honor Him. Those phrases come up over and over and over again. And so here's an amazing opportunity, especially here in America, to really take that to heart, to really put that into practice. Have you ever thought about it this way, that instead of thinking of it maybe as Turkey Day, what about being thankful? And instead of Turkey Day, we could call it maybe Thankful Thursday. It's uh, always on a Thursday here in America for, for Thanksgiving. A Thankful Thursday. In fact, thanks shouldn't be just limited to Thursdays. But as the Bible shows, we should always be in that kind of an attitude, a thankful attitude. In Luke chapter 1, verse 49, it gives us an idea. If you can't uh, imagine some of the things to be thankful for, here's one way to begin that thought process. Luke 1.49 says, He who is mighty has done great things for me. Think about that for a minute. What great things has God done for you? Wouldn't it be wonderful to take a couple of minutes on Thankful Thursday, on Thanksgiving Day, and recount some of those great things that God has done for you? Well, it would give a whole different perspective to Turkey Day. So I think we should take that to heart. Let's make this Thanksgiving season truly a season to be thankful and give thanks. That's BT Daily. We'll see you next time.